Welcome back everyone, Mudford here. I'm out in the shop. The ATVXC season is now over. I had an engine failure on my last race. I was leading my class. And I actually still got first place in my class because I was the only one in the old class that was still on the lead lap of the race when I broke down. Uh, everyone else was already done racing, but I had not been lapped by the leaders. So it was kind of like a bonus lap for me, and that was when it broke down. So it's not every day you can completely destroy your engine and still get first place. So pretty excited about getting first place, not excited about destroying the engine. So here we are. I think it could be the timing chain, not 100% sure. Uh, I was taking all the valve cover bolts out. I had had some issues in the past and I didn't um, change the timing chain. I should have, I did a bunch of other work and it was all rushed between races and I didn't have a timing chain. And I think that probably kind of bit me. And to top it all off, last night I was gonna tear my engine um, down a little bit and try to find the problem. And I actually got a little space cleaned up in the garage where I can work. Most of you probably wouldn't think this is clean, but this is pretty clean for me. Started tearing this apart. Had a bolt that I could not get off and stripped it. Okay, so this was a real struggle. Where am I at here? Impact for the win. These things are really handy. I actually got this from my dad. It's pretty old. You can see it's starting to mushroom out. Probably not the safest, but I tried welding. I'll show you some failed attempts right here of me trying to weld a nut onto the top of the strip bolt. Well, that didn't take. I, I drilled a slot with a grinder and you can see I got a little too close right here. Took a little nick out of there, but that should be fine. So then I got this uh, impact in here and just wailed on it with the mini sledge. And you can see I got it to come loose. So now hopefully we can get this taken off and take a peek in here and see exactly what we find out. Ugh. Maybe it's not so bad after all. No, it does look like we have a broken chain. And it looks like our bolts came off. So my sprocket's set in here. Chewed up the inside a little bit. Not too bad. Here's a bolt. And it's just hammered. Yep. We got a broken chain here. So I'm going to go ahead and get this out. It's just what I thought but I do have some other damage. Um, we'll have to see, probably take the head off and see if we got any damage. 